We're also watching airlines this morning. Shares of Southwest, they are on the move fractionally higher right now by about nine cents of a percent after the airline said it's going to implement what they're calling a shareholder rights plan. And this is an effort to fend off activist investor firm Elliott Management. Shareholders will be entitled to purchase one new share for every share they own at a 50 percent discount. But that's only if Elliott or another investor acquires at least 12 and a half percent of the company. All right. So they're calling it a shareholder rights plan. What you should know this as more colloquially is a poison pill. Nice, Brad. Yeah. I mean, that's what it boils down to. They're trying to make sure that they can fend off any yeah. major type of activist play that would impact the airline operator, the seats on the board, um, and especially if Elliot were to assume a certain position, 12.5%, in this particular case, of the outstanding shares of the company. That's exactly right. And it's interesting because, I mean, our succession fans out there, Ooh. like myself, are going to be familiar with the hostile takeover, but the poison pill would protect against that. However, obviously, you can tell by the name, not always giving them the best overall outlook, but it does enable the shareholders to potentially get the best deal possible here. I do want to pull out a quote here because uh, we heard Executive Chairman Gary Kelly saying, in light of the potential for Elliott to significantly increase its position in Southwest, the board did determine that adopting the rights plan is prudent to fulfill its fiduciary duties to all shareholders. And the board does continue to believe it has the right strategy, the right team in place. Uh, the plan would be triggered if a person or group does acquire a stake of over 12.5% of the firm moving forward. And like you mentioned, Brad Elliott disclosing roughly $1.9 billion stake back in June in that letter to the board and said they feel that their suggestions could boost the stock by over 75% over the course of the next year. But uh, the details of those plans, they included them. But, you know, obviously Southwest Board saying that they've, they've got things under lock and key here.